guys, so I want to show y'all how to make this sweet breakfast dessert. And I have a little witchy twist to it at the end. So first of all, you want to get some strawberries. And I got a pack like this, and I'm using two. So you can get one of the big packs. Good morning, Jade. Um, yeah, so you get two of those packs, and then I'm just cleaning them up, and then I'm just slicing them in half. Oh, it's fuzzy. There we go. And I'm just slicing them in half. So I'm going to finish that up, and then I will be right back. Okay, and now that I have all these cut up, what I've done is I've opened a can of sliced pineapple. And I am draining them. As best I can with one hand. I'm not washing them off because the juice they have is awesome for this dish. Okay, and then I'm going to slice them in the can. So I've sliced them and now I'm draining them. Some of them didn't slice up. How rude. You can always buy them already done like this, but these were cans were on sale. So I didn't mind chopping them up, you know. Save a buck. Mm, they're so sweet. And then a can of peaches. Should just throw them all in there. This is really hard to do one handed. And then I'm going to take... Um, I guess I could just take my hand, or you could take a knife and go in there, but I got nails on, so this will work. I just kind of slice them into bite-sized pieces. And then you want to let it drain. That way, most of the juice will come off. There we go. Let it drain in a strainer for a minute. As soon as it's drained, you want a lot of the liquid off. Okay. Now this is the same um, towel that I use for the strawberries, that's why you see the red. I pour them first onto a paper towel just to help get more of the liquid gone. Kind of roll it around in the paper towel. You know, you don't want it completely dry, but you want to get as much liquid off as possible. And then chunk it together with the strawberries. And this is where we're at right now. Kind of roll those together. That. And then, next, what you want to do is get a sprig of rosemary that I've gotten here. And then I am going, I hope you can see because you're on my chin. I am adding rosemary to it. Oh, rosemary, oh my god, it smells so good and it complements the fruit so much. So, that's my witchy twitch, twist because it's from my garden. Next, I add, oh, I'm adding the condensed cream. Who are you looking for? Can I get a plain hide and seek? Well, I can't tell you where he's at if you're playing hide and seek, dude. <laughs> okay, so you want to add the whole can and then uh, mix it up. Let me get my fork. I'm going to work the best I can with one hand here. And Wow, oh, okay. I really should have got my tripod. So I'm mixing that up. I have no idea. And this is your breakfast salad. <laughs> the dogs and the animals are going ballistic, okay? Let me tell you. So this is the breakfast salad. You can add this on top of pancakes. Ooh, rosemary pancakes. I gotta do that rosemary pancake video for you guys one day. On your pancakes or eat it as a side dish with your breakfast. Alright guys, I hope you enjoy this um, video. And I will see you guys at the next one. And as always, blessed be.